Hi, my name is Saren, I'm from Indie Games, and I'm back again playing Tales of Symphonia. We are headed for the coast. No, we're headed for the trail. I'm going the complete opposite direction that I need to be going. Oh. I'm seriously tired of this desert. Well then, do you want to go back to the village? How am I supposed to do that? I was banished. Then stop talking as if you were on vacation. Sorry. Wow. Okay, so. You should be going this way, I believe. Don't jump at me. Okay. <laughs> this is gonna be a piece of cake. Wait, this is where I came from. Yeah, get away from me. Whoops, I was looking at the map. <laughs> well, okay, you're gonna be dead in like three seconds. Come on. There we go. That was amazing, Kratos. That was definitely impressive. It was nothing. Let's go. So cool. Awesome. I found some rice. Why did that guy have rice? Kind of weird. All right, I can't see. There we go. Oh no, my map's gone. All right. Oh, here we go. Here's the trail. So what's over there? Anything? Oh, a cutscene. Kratos. What is it? Why did you take on the job of guarding Colette? Huh. I'm a mercenary. That's how we earn money to live. In other words, it's just a job. That's correct. That's really all? Yes. Uh-huh. Oh my gosh! I <laughs> got ganged up on. The guys don't provide enough experience for this to really be worth it. Yeah, you're dead already. We're counting on you. I've never heard that one. That's funny. Okay, these are like special cutscenes. Hee <laughs> hee. You seem happy. Yeah. It might seem inconsiderate, but I'm having a lot of fun and I'm really happy. Why? Well, it's because I've made a lot of friends. You were my only friend until then, you know? Yeah, we're stuck out- we stuck out like a sore thumb. No, I was the only one that stuck out. You were just nice and always kept me company. That's why you're my favorite person in Isalia. Oh, uh, thanks. I think those improve your relationship with other characters. I forget how you, um, get on Noish. No, that's not it. I know there's a way to ride Noish. Whoops. Oh, hey, look. I didn't know I could do that. I just messing around with stuff. Um, but anyway, I think those improve your relationships with the other characters. I think there's stuff that, like, you have to have a certain relationship level to get. There we go. Alright, we're moving on. This is pretty. Stop! What? Is she a friend of yours, Lloyd? Mm, not that I'm aware of. Is the Chosen of Mana among you? That's me. Prepare to die. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh no, what should I do? I did it again. You don't need to worry about it. If she had not fallen in, you might have been killed. But... Well... I guess I do feel a bit sorry for her. I hope she's okay. Even assuming her weight to be 45 kilograms, and this hole to be 10 meters deep, and calculating the gravity constant at 9.8, the impact shouldn't have been fatal. Gravity constant? I don't understand what you just said, but she's alive, right? Probably. Still, man, she's got some bad luck standing right on top of a trapdoor and all. And why was there a trapdoor here? 
It's not a trap. It's a hidden maintenance passage oh. for the mountain path. We should get moving. Hey, shouldn't we try to find out who that woman was? She'll come after us again on her own. This area is too confined, and the footing is poor. It would be wise not to linger. So basically, it's a dirt path. See, it's funny because everybody else has something different to say. Alright, let's do this. Hey, how's it going? What are you? Oh, look at the little witch in the background. Hold on, I need your... Look, she's so cute! Come on, can I focus on the, the, the witch, please? Wait, ah, oh, there we go. Ow, you big meanie! Oh, come here, you! Oi! Yeah, hey, there we go. All right. Also, may I reiterate, that is not a bear. <laughs> Creepy. Wait, hold on, is there anything over here? No. Just a bunch of monsters. And a battle staff. Cool, here you go. Uh, rain, hold on. Whoops, that's not what I wanted. It's okay, I'll run around as rain. Here we go. I need to just destroy everything. Alright, hey, there we go. More cabbage. And we're off. Hi, can I help you? Yeah, Alright then. Just plodding along, huh? No, leave me alone. I'm done with you. Well. <laughs> yeah, you guys just do your thing. Ooh. There's a save point here. That's not totally suspicious or anything. Let's do it. Okay. Now then. You get out of my way. Weirdo. This is like a narrow, creepy little bath. Any more items to be had? Hey, how's it going? I just want this. Thanks. Bye. No! <laughs> I got stuck. What level are we? 12, 12, 11, 12, and 10. I can live with that. Oh no, a door. Not a door. It is now. Wait! Yeah, good job. Wow, she caught up with us. Oh, thank good. <clears throat> Don't move. A wise decision. I won't be caught off guard this time. Prepare to die. Do we fight her? Yep, we get a fighter. What is music? Wait, hold on. 
Can we? No, 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 that's not what I wanted. Can we actually use a magic lens on her right now? Because that's kind of hilarious. Oh my gosh, you can. That's so great. I wonder if she stays in the book like that. As a monster. Ow, you meanie. I don't really like playing as Sheena in this game. Oh crap, she's over limit. Oh, cool. Ow, you big meanie. Yeah, come here. No, who just died? Actually, um, um, Kratos, can you bring Gina's back? Hey, hey, leave her alone, you brat. Oh, I got her. Oh, I don't have ATP. Ow. Why are you such a big meanie? How much health do you have left? Oh, not very much. No. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Yeah, good, we did it, okay. <laughs> good, 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 good. Just you wait! I swear I will kill you all next time! Yeah, she's all dirty. Wait! Why are people trying to kill us? What do you think? There are always those that reject salvation. Maybe she's a desire. Who knows? At any rate, we are in constant danger. That's all we have to know. Those clothes... Professor, something wrong? No, it's nothing. Let's go. Yeah. Anyway, let's go look for a place where we can get a ship. Goodness. Lloyd. Hmm, what? Fighting in a party means that coordination with your partners is important as well. Here's a tutorial. Yeah. Your choice of strategy and orders can greatly affect the tide of battle. Don't forget that you are not alone. Yeah, I know that already. Heh. <laughs> Unison attack. Um... Yes, because I don't remember how to use it. An attack in which the party members attack consecutively to, to deliver greater damage. In order to unleash a unity attack, the unity attack gauge must be filled. I will increase by successfully scoring multiple hits on enemies during battle when the Yeah. Okay, so I click. Alright. Um, if the initial Oh, okay, I remember how to do this. Okay, that I didn't know. The set special move one after another. They do not consume TP. In addition, depending on the special moves used, compound special attacks may occur. Um, yeah. I'm just gonna skim this really quick in the same manner. Please note the controls character's unity attacks are the same as text settings. Plus, the respective people choose which techniques to use during the unity attack, but until you are custom, it's best to avoid and use the buttons only. Custom. Okay, um, let me... Oh, unity attack, here we go. Oh, it's just these. Oh, okay, I remember. Okay, so I'm just gonna make him, uh, this be... We'll do fireball and... I'll let this be fireball. Okay, I can live with that. An assassin! Who was that girl earlier? I hope we get to see her again. What are you talking about? She's trying to kill you. Yeah, once we become friends, I'll have to ask her why she's doing that. Huh, are you kidding me? How do you become on plan on becoming friends with her? If I could talk. Hmm? What would you suggest? Me? How am I supposed to know? Try to come up with a plan before we see her again. Wait, I have to come up with a plan? Yep. No! I'm a saving maniac. Okay, now then. Are there any secrets for me? I must know. 
I'm gonna go traipsing off this direction. Look for things. I'm looking for the monument things that let me ride Noish. This looks slightly suspicious. Hi, is there something here? Uh, I guess not. Anyway, I'm looking for the things that let me ride Noish as well. Okay. As well as those little cutscene points. Sure. Oh, cool. Oh, there's the gauge. Wow, that's kind of huge and ugly, isn't it? I guess it's okay. Um, there's nothing over here. Oh, what's this? Hey, here's one. That woman. What is it? Ah, it's just the clothes the assassin was wearing. Don't you think they were rather unique? Oh. Uh, indeed, they aren't something you see every day. I know! I bet they're dwarven clothes! The ones I'm wearing now were made by my father. Well, don't they look kind of similar? How can you call that similar? Is this what happens when one is raised by a dwarf? That's kind of mean, Kratos. It's kind of it's messed up. Look at this cute little bridge. It's adorable. It has about six polygons, but that's fine. Don't worry about it, Colette. It'll be okay. Did you actually get something, Colette? No, I didn't think so. It just looked like she did for a second. You there. Oh! Oh, there's the monument. I'll have to go back to that. Don't do it. Don't do it. I'm watching you. Alright. Ah. Don't you sometimes think that what we're doing is meaningless? No. No, we won't know if it's meaningless until we do it. A very simple-minded answer. Hey. I doubt that there'll ever be an ending that'll satisfy everyone. Well, there might be... maybe. See, you agree with me too. But I guess since I'm like this, that's why you and I make a good team. I like how you always force yourself to be optimistic. Why do I feel like that's not a compliment? No, leave me alone. I wanna save. Go away. Uh, let's see if there's anything good over here. See if there's anything around the bend. What is this area? Oh, there's another one of Nova's caravans over there. I'm exploring! Oh, the unity gauge uh, stays full. I did not know that. Whoa, I'm getting some lag. It's okay, though. Come on, die! How tough are these grasshoppers? There we go. Ah, you big beanie. There we go. I love that their weapons actually change when you equip them stuff. It's very cool. I know in one of these there's like a hidden, um, hidden treasure chest. Hey, hey, jeez. Oh, it's a cockatrice! Hold on, I need to get you on my magic lens. <laughs> Look, you're so great! Excuse me. I'm just gonna... No, leave me alone. Is somebody gonna heal me? Well... Uh, I was kinda hoping... Oh, nobody has any TP. Awesome. Ah, uh, no! Dang! Stupid cockatrice, leave me alone! How much health do you have left? A lot. Yeah, come on, come after me and leave everybody else alone. Ah, god! Why is this thing so overpowered? Wait, what? Oh. 
And why is this such a like ridiculously intense battle? Jeez. You died like seven times. Yeah, you bet I have terrible grade after that. God. I'm not gonna hang out with Nova. Who are you? Who are you? Oh my, we don't get visitors very often. May I help you? Oh no, we were just passing by. Are you in the middle of a pilgrimage? We are traveling while studying the animals of the world. I'm a zoologist. Really? That's a weird thing to do in these dangerous times. Ow! Traveling the world in pursuit of knowledge. That's wonderful. Ha ha ha. I just like seeing all sorts of rare animals. We even saw a giant glowing bird. Glowing bird? It may have been Aska, the summoned spirit of light. Really? That bird is a summoned spirit? I see, that would explain why it's a species I've never seen before. Say, tell us about the time you saw it. The information might come in handy, and besides, I want to hear the story. In that case, I think it would be better to ask my children. I d actually didn't get a good look at the bird. Okay, I'll try asking them. Hey, how's it going? Oh, you're... Sarah, thanks again. Lloyd, do you know her? She helped us out when it was just the two of us. Oh my, thank you so much for looking after these children. It's my pleasure. Sarah, there's something we'd like to ask you. If you know anything about the glowing bird, we'd like you to tell us. I imagine that bird can only be found among steep, impregnable mountains. Ones you can never reach by foot. Why do you think that? Because we've been everywhere that one can walk to. If you could find it in one of those places, I think we would have already encountered it. I see. Not gonna give me a free heal this time. Alright, kid. Say, tell us in detail about the time you saw the glowing bird. Ah, it was on the Osa Trail. We were camping out near the peak and that glowing bird appeared. Osa Trail, hmm. Also, the wind was strong that day. A tree nearby played a mysterious melody as the nuts shook in the wind. It was like a beautiful song. The nut tree nuts playing a mysterious melody? What the heck is that? That's probably the ling lingkite tree that is said to grow in the high places. It's said that when the nuts shake in the wind, they make a beautiful sound like bells. Hmm, I didn't know there was a tree like that. But doesn't that mean we can meet Aska if we just go to the Osa Trail? No, the tree isn't there anymore. Either someone cut it down or took it away. Or it was carried away in a landslide or something. Yeah, we didn't see any tree like that when we went there before. The stump we saw near the peak might have been it. We've traveled all over the world, but we've yet to see that tree again. That tree is thought to be extinct from over-harvesting and natural disasters. I don't think it will be easy to find. Hmm. So depressing. You know, on that day I picked nuts from the tree. And, um, it makes a pretty sound. That's... Could we see it? So this is a like, kind nut. Of it does make a pretty sound. I'll give that one to you. I have some more. Thank you very much. Yay, I got a nut. <laughs> I'll sum up the situation in which they encountered the glowing bird. First, they encountered it on the Osa Trail. This indicates that the glowing bird only appears in high places. Next, a linkite tree must make a, made a beautiful sound, as if the nuts were producing a melody. Finally, on that day there was a strong wind, and the sound of the linkite nuts was carried a long distance by the wind. I think that about sums it up. They said that after traveling around the world, they went back to the Osa Trail again, but the linkite tree was already gone. And they've yet to find another linkite tree on any of their journeys. At least, there weren't any they could get to by foot. Hint hint. Which means in order to meet Asuka, we need to search for a linkite tree in a place you can't get to on foot. That sounds impossible. Yes, well, we don't need to accomplish it immediately. And even if we did find a linkite tree, it wouldn't do us any good if it was dead. The sound has to be carried on the wind, and playing a melody sounds difficult too. Couldn't you do something about a dread tree with your healing arts? My power alone wouldn't be enough. In order to heal something that's already dead, I'd need something that could strengthen my skills. Something that could call forth the, to the Linkite Tree's will to live. Something like an X-Fear or even just a shard of one. Also, if it's dead, that means the ground there is weak. We need to replenish the earth and make it nourishing again. This sounds like a side quest. Dad's the only one I can think of who might have a spare X-Fear. 
Although, if there are any other dwarves around, they might have one too. There's nothing we can do. Let's get on a, up on Aska. Fascinating. Whoa. I see now. That's impressive, the way that you found the rules of how it works. But all we've learned is that meeting Aska is hard. Well, I suppose so. I've gone ahead and made note of the information you've assembled. Feel free to talk to me anytime you want to hear it. Okay. Cool. Wait, there's a little path over here. Does this matter? What is this little path? Is this just an alternate way to leave? Yeah, it is. <laughs> I was excited about the little path! Okay, now then. Um, this actually goes somewhere, so I'm gonna go back and get... Whoops. That... Ah. I'm gonna go back and get that, um, long distance thing that I saw before. Oh, I forgot, we're still almost dead. Hold on, wait. Hold on, wait, I don't remember how to use unison attacks. Crap, um... I don't remember how to use unison attacks. Dang. Oh, that's right, I have to click. Oh god, why? Every time. Why are these things so mighty? I need to do some more grinding. Whoops. There, jeez. Enemies deserve no mercy. I got an achievement for unison, using a unison attack. How much gold do I have? A lot. Okay, we need to go back and find. Um, I'm gonna switch Colette. Hi, There's a dog in the room. Luna, can you go, please? I'm gonna I'm going to go back to. Ah, walk right into it. This is a dangerous situation. It is, Kratos. Mostly because we have no health. No! I didn't see you, you stupid grasshopper. Stupid grasshopper, I'm not fighting you. Rain, don't you die. I'm watching you down there. God dang it. Why are the enemies in this suddenly so much harder to deal with? I don't understand. Stunlock him! Kill him! Ow! There, jeez. They do give us a lot of experience. I'm probably not supposed to be in this area yet. Alright, let's go. Anyway, what I was trying to say is that I'm going to go back to a city and save, well, heal, rather. Alright, give me this guide stone. God, leave me alone! Don't get too there, now we've gone back to the easier to deal with enemies. There, geez. Yeah, see, these only give 28, so I'm clearly not supposed to be over there yet. <laughs> give me this. Yeah, how do I... How do I do that, though? Oh, there we go. Aw, nice! Yay! Okay, so what we need to do... 
is go to the city. Yeah, you leave me alone. I'm faster than you now. Here it is. Okay, we're saving. Uh, I've already put four hours into this game. Look at that thing jumping around over there. Okay, let's do this. We're supposed to go to Palma Costa. Um... Colette. Hello. Welcome to Azul. Doggy. Oh. This one's Pookie. Pookie Pookie. Yeah, you can name all the dogs as Colette. Whether you need food or a room, the Seagull Inn is your service. Hey, bud. There aren't any passenger ships running. It's too dangerous. I only got here by getting a ride on a boat. Get... <sighs> Ifried. That's who we're looking for. No, he's not here anymore. He said he was going back to his hometown. Well, that's unfortunate. Heal us. <laughs> Welcome. One night is 120 gal. Let's do it. Man, it's hard to believe Colette has wings now. Yeah, I was surprised too. Say, Colette, what's going to happen to the next seal? What? Next you, hmm, maybe you get an angel halo? Or your body starts glowing? I don't think it'll be horns or fangs or anything. I mean, you're an angel after all. Gina, stop. Okay, now it's time for children to be getting to bed. Colette. It's weird, isn't it? Having wings? No, it's not. Even if you become an angel, you're still you, okay? Thank you, Lloyd. Nothing in here to look at. Hey, Cat's Club! Meow! Uh, yeah. How can I quell these feelings I have, Ifrid? If you're looking for Ifrid, we heard he went back to his hometown. What did you say? Is that true? Uh, yeah. Isn't it, Lloyd? Yeah, so it seems. Anyway, this is my chance. Okay. Hey, bud. How's it going? My granddaughter is so naive. She lets herself be toyed around with by that rogue. Alright. Uh, if I can get out of the house. Why are you on the ceiling? How am I supposed to buy things from you if you're up there? Hello? Why are you up there? Whatever. Hey, bud. There's no design human ranch in this area, so we can live and relax and live in peace. A tiny village like this probably isn't even worth attacking. Dude, don't say that. You're like asking for your tiny village to get attacked. Oh. Hello. Go east across the ocean to get to Palma Costa, the largest city in Silveron. Yeah, sure. Hey, bud. Someday I'm going on a journey in this boat. Sure. Hello, small child. Waves are fun! Can I play in the waves? Oh, I can! Splash Splash! I like that you make little footprints. That scared me. Hello, child. They say Max is head over heels in love with Lila. Although Lila doesn't seem to be interested in him at all. Who are these people? Hey, Cats Club! Hey! This is the... Um... Dang, I don't remember how to do this. Meow, let's begin. Oh, I should've asked. Oh, I gotta- I have to use that? Yeah, okay. Is 
Is this it? It's just Simon Says. I love that it's Genus doing this. Yeah, right. Apparently you like singing. Yay, we did it. What did we get from it? Yeah, you did it! Five apple gels. Does Lloyd have anything to say about this? No. Hey, how's it going? Say, don't you look a bit like that wanted poster? No. Totally not. What does she say if you're not playing as Lloyd then? Oh, she says the same thing to everyone. Okay, whatever. The Chosen's gonna come here soon. What if you're talking to the Chosen? Yeah, whatever. Hello. I came to stock up on fish, but they're not fishing right now. Poor baby. Whoop. What's the matter with you? You're going to refuse my request? He's returned to his hometown of Lewin. It's not like that. There are giant monsters at sea now. It's dangerous, and I care about you too much to let you come aboard. Oh, these are Max and Lila. That's all. Fine, then you go deliver the letter for me. No, why should I have to go as a go-betweener for my rival in love? Oh, please, stop whining. Fine. You there, excuse me. Us? Do you see anyone else here? I'd like you to deliver this letter for me to Eifried and Lewin. We can't deliver it if we can't cross the ocean. If you'll deliver it, I'll have Max take you on his boat. You can't be serious. Okay. Then it's settled. All right, Max? I I'm not going to do it. You're kidding me. Are you saying it's all right if my letter doesn't make it to Ifrid? Lila, no, I mean, it's not... I don't mean that. Then what do you mean? If you keep making a fuss about this, I'll just do this on my own. Okay, okay, I'll go, I'll go, damn it. You should have just said that from the start. Bushy. Then it's in your hands now. Make sure it gets to him. Can we read it? I kind of don't wanna. She's really pushy. I think I just said that. Let me know when you're ready to leave. I thought he was crying. Don't cry, man. It's gonna be okay. Hello. You're looking for a ship? The only ship in this port still operating is the fishing boat that belongs to Max, the head son of the head fisherman. Yeah, that's nice. Hey! Come on out, my dear! You're a little bit weird. Uh, come on, there's gotta be... Where is she? Is she not back here? Yeah, there she is. Shh, don't tell anyone I'm here! Funny. There's nothing else to do in here? Oh, whatever. Wow, the camera zoom. Hello! What, you're looking for a ship? We're fishermen, try someone else. You want to go to sea? You should ask the boss. The boss said no, so... Alright. Have you seen my dog? I believe he's at the front. Hey, what's up? Hey, did you hear? There's a weird guy who drifts around the ocean in a homemade boat. I wonder who that is. Hi, I want to buy some stuff from you. Um, yeah, we definitely need more of these. Seaweed, yummy! <laughs> okay, I don't think I have anything to sell other than this. Um... Keep everything else. So I am going to go save, and then I'll bug that guy to go to leave. I think there is a save point in here. Yeah, there is. I should know, I just used it. Yeah, out of the way, bud. Ah, stuck on everything. Alright. Let's do it. Going to Lewin. Come here. Are you ready? Yup. 
Okay, then let's set sail. Don't blame me if we run into any monsters. Look at this tiny boat. Now we can finally go to the next seal. Yeah! I was afraid this journey would force me on a boat sooner or later. Poor Rain. Look at this tiny boat. I guess they could all go hide in the cabin or something if it rained. We're at sea! We're at sea! Settle down! This thing's tiny! Do you want to fall out? Gee, I'm so sorry my ship is too tiny for you. I'm gonna fall! Bitch freaking out. Awesome. Why are those clouds shrinking? Or the mountains? Oh, it's the draw dist pulling it. The draw distance pulling out. Awesome. Yay, Lewin! And once we get to Lewin, I'm gonna save. Again. <laughs> Yay! What? Paul and Costa? Where's Lewin? This is the biggest city in Silveron? We're here. Thanks, Max. What are you going to do now? I'll requ request escort from a Palma Costa warship or something. Well, take care. Sorry for making you take us all the way out here. Be careful on your way back. You too. Okay, let's go look for clues about the next seal. AKA, we're stranded here. We cannot go back for now. Hey, a pirate. I'm totally bored. Because of the monsters, we can't leave port. That's nice. I don't even talk to you people. Wait, what's on the end of this? Another dude. Talk to me. I came all the way over here. Oh. I think you find his son at one point. Doggy! I'm not gonna get this achievement or whatever, but let's try. Come here. Bark! This little one feels like a teddy. His tail is so cute. The area is under control of Magnus. Oh, great. Magnus and Dor. Hello. Buy some food. I think it's so funny that you buy food in this game. Oh, here we go. You know, I actually really hate onion. Um, I'm just not a fan. You know, I just realized I'm spending all this money on food. It's really funny. Like grocery shopping. Whoops. Sorry, my computer's freaking out. Alright. I do need bread, though. I think this counts as bread. Oops. Yes, I'm spending all of my money on food. Ha ha ha, you're very funny, but... Oh. Hmm? What is it, Lloyd? I think there are more things I must learn in order to fight powerful enemies. What? Lloyd, you will grow stronger. Huh? It is easy to continue recklessly swinging a sword, and that is probably enough to take care of your average enemy. But it won't serve you when faced with a truly strong opponent. You, Lloyd, are in the midst of realizing that. Therefore, you will undoubtedly grow even stronger. Y you think so? Grow strong, Lloyd. Battle tips. <laughs> I'm not gonna read it. I just want to save point. I don't have money for any of this, so... <laughs> Where's the inn? I'm just... Whoop! Cutscene! Oh no! There she goes again! Ow! What did she do that for? Oh, I'm sorry. Ah, the pollen potion that we just received. Hey lady, that was a very valuable potion. How are you planning on making up for this? I'll buy a replacement potion right away. Replacement potion? You seriously, that's going to be enough to appease my anger? Oh, come on now, you just sound like an idiot. What did you say? Do you know who we are? And I should care because... Why, you little. Stop. I'd like to leave here as soon as we can. Don't start any unnecessary trouble. 
I agree. Let's just have them replace the potion. Ah, you got off lucky this time, kid. Hurry up and go buy that potion. There's no need to bother, Colette. No, I ran into them, so I have to pay for it. Fine, alright. Um, is this the end? Yes, okay, good. <laughs> I don't have any money for you. Um, we're fine anyway. Okay, so... Come on. Thank goodness it doesn't cost anything to save. Alright, I'm gonna stand... Actually, I'm gonna stand on the stairs. Because I feel like it. <laughs> um, so, that's gonna be it for now. I will come back to this pretty quick, and then we will continue our journey in Palma Costa. So until then, goodbye for now.